I've never thought I'd be here for this. Never expected it. The coal miner's daughter laid to rest today at her Hurricane Mills ranch. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to News 2 at 6. I'm Bob Mueller. 100 guests said farewell to country music icon Loretta Lynn today. The singer passed away peacefully in her sleep at her home Tuesday morning. Today, a private burial service was held for family members and close friends. Stephanie Langston was in Humphreys County for the service you will see only here on News 2. Well, surreal is how I would describe that moment when Loretta was transported from the mansion around the bend and in front of this memorial from her fans taken to the family cemetery. In the hills of Humphreys County, all seemed to stand still. A peaceful escort for the queen of country music, many with silent tears and heavy hearts. It's just very humbling to be here today. It was a trip to Loretta Lynn's ranch planned months ago for Michelle Powers and her sisters. I love all her songs because they um, talk about her life. And all she overcame. And all she overcame. Loretta inspiring the group of women as children from Indiana. I think she leaves on so many memories and stories. She's a legend. You know, she's a coal miner's daughter. She is bad. She is a very cool woman. I, I respect her fully, so. Loretta's story of triumph and continued grace resonating with fans from all over the world. I'll bet you if she was up in there uh, in her younger days, I guess, you know, she would probably invite you right into there. Who knows? Probably have breakfast with her. <laughs> it's true. Loretta loved her fans, and today, mementos of thank yous shower her front steps, from flowers to burning candles, even a penny from Del Berger. Picked it up because it's supposed to be good luck, and I put it in Loretta Lynn's pot there. A small token as the hills from Kentucky to Humphreys County are a bit quieter tonight, but we all know the music of Loretta Lynn will forever be heard around the world. Well, I was born to call my Loretta's family at peace knowing that the queen is now home in heaven. Reporting from Hurricane Mills, Stephanie Langston, News 2. And plans for a public memorial service are forthcoming. News 2 has more coverage of Loretta Lynn and her life. You can find it all on our website at WKRN.com.